What's up everybody, welcome back to another drawing tutorial. Today we're going to be drawing Cristiano Ronaldo from the side. I've drawn him from the front a couple of times. He's kind of looking over his shoulder and we got the Ronaldo sort of number seven. Well, the Ronaldo anyway. Maybe we could see like the top of the seven. I could add a little bit of it. So I'm on a landscape page. Use a pencil eraser for these. Sketch it out lightly. Hit pause if I go too fast. So he's in profile. So I like to start with the noses when people are in profile, right? So just over here, center point to my page about there. We're going to go over to the right. We're going to start with this diagonal bumpy line for the tip of his nose, right? So this will curve around here. Just go in like so. And then his nostril there and you could shadow this up a little bit like that and then the back of his nostril here comes around like so and with noses sort of sometimes you can have these little sort of hatching lines and stuff coming out the sort of like inside of the nose for the bridge of the nose you know all these lines like so so at the top of this right we get his brow that kind of curves around this way and the eyebrow on the other side is quite big there and then just some dark sort of eyelashes and stuff inside here, but you can't see much. It's just all shadowed up. It's mostly just eyebrow in there. Okay, so his other eyebrow and eye is across from here, right? So across from this eyebrow here is where the eye is, okay? So we're gonna go eyelash lines, right? So it goes up and then down, curves down. Like that. Right, and then so this would be like eyelashes on top, right? And then we have a bit more, like another sort of eyelid line or something coming this way. And then the back of his eye goes that way. So that's like the top eyelid line, right? And then his actual eyeball, we sort of drawn in here. It's around like that. And you could, this curves around then here, like so. And then his iris. So it kind of goes around up into here somewhere. So this big circle and then the pupil is back in here. Looking that way. So then we can see like a little bit of his tear duct just there and then the skin underneath his eye sort of like curved down and around 
that way. And then like he's got like bottom eyelash lines. There as well. Right, it's a bit tricky to draw now because we're sort of turned around and all that kind of stuff. So there's some extra sort of eye lines in here as well. And like the bridge of his nose would be here. Like so, right? So delicate sort of little lines. Right, so then at the back of his eye, his temple just sort of goes up around here. And then he's got his eyebrow, very um, formed eyebrows Cristiano has. So arcs a big curved line up this way. And then down the back. Like that. that kind of a thing, right? So then the rest of his forehead kind of bumps out here. And then I'll go up towards his hair. That way. Right, so we'll go back down to his nose and add his top lip. So it goes, it kind of bumps this way first and then sticks out. And then we bring it around so his mouth is open, right? So it goes down this way. And then around for his bottom lip. Like that. And this goes into his chin. Then which sort of bumps out this way. And then his lips. So his mouth is open, but we got like... So it's hard to, what way would that be now? So let's say there's some teeth. Okay, so top lip here comes around like so. And then the bottom lip down that way. And then this is open here. And then it comes around for the top lip. Just kind of goes, it's got like a little section that just goes there. And then we got like his top teeth. Like that. And then this is just like skin all in here. So, and it's just all kind of dark in here, so I will color it black. And it gradually gets kind of lighter as we go out. but it's just kind of shadowed in underneath his lip. Like so, and then he could have like that line that lips have there on that side. And a line coming out from his nostril, just sort of on the side of his nose, like so. Like that, right. So that's pretty tricky now to so pause it sort of there. So then his jaw comes down this way, it joins his neck, right? So his head is turned. So it joins his neck down here and his shoulder will come across this. 
we'll just go up the other way. Maybe go up this way. And then we have like a, like a skin fold sort of here. And then his jaw will go up towards his ear on that side. So he has got all these like folding skin lines on his neck. So his jaw then sort of joins his ear lobe here. And it curves around for the ear. Like that, right? Bit of a shadow on his chin and like his brow just going up this way as well. Right, and coming out from behind his ear, we have his sideburns. So they're just like shaved hair going up this way around into his temple. side of his head in there so this is just like a very shaved textured part of his hair and then he's got like a cheekbone that goes this way right so then ear lines inside so the easiest way is just this kind of Curving earlobe sort of line like that, and then some more like this. And of course, you can do more than that if you want, and he always has sort of earring an earring hole like so. the skin just being pulled All right, like so so then so his hairline right so we got like his fringe sort of just coming across here and then he has a piece of hair that like whips around this way like texture lines underneath that and then his hair is like long on top and shorter on the sides right so we got like a couple more sort of hair spikes and stuff here wavy sort of texture and then shorter on the side here that and then it comes out from the front and sort of bumps back around the back of his head in this particular hairstyle that he has anyway right and then there's like a little bit of a longer section again so it's like tapered back textures kind of here and the back of his head comes down around for the back of his neck like so and this is just his hairline coming down behind his ear this sort of shaved headline shaved hair going down that way spine and his neck muscle there so let's see 
So I'll just bring out the corner of his mouth a little bit further there. Okay, so his back, like the color of the jersey, right, comes across here, across to his shoulder, down that way. And then we have all these skin folds and wrinkles and stuff on his neck, because his head is like turned, right? So you gotta like add some of these. Some of them can be thicker than others, so some of them can be like heavier lines. all these wrinkles like so you can do as much of that as you want or as little I think I might erase some it's a bit much one or two should be okay Okay, so, sorry about that, but it, sometimes, yeah, less is more with these kind of things, you know. Especially with line drawings. All right, so, let's do his other shoulder. So, it comes down, it's more his back. It comes out down that way. And then we have the white collar. I think this is a United jersey there. some more textures to his hair that's like the general shape for him now Right, so we'll try and add Ronaldo coming across here. So R first, capital R. All right, you gotta like thicken them up. So R like that, and we're gonna curve a line. You could draw like a curve if you wanted around, right? So we'll go with the O. And it can be wavy, you know, because fabric moves and stuff so it doesn't have to be like perfect because it's on his jersey Ronaldo, right, and then like some sort of folding fabric lines, jersey lines, just going down this way. And just clean up some of these lines now. Right. Can we see some of the seven? I'll draw a little bit. So it'll be seven there. 
and you can tidy up some of your edge. Another hairline there, maybe. I do do do. Right, and that's his. This was lip. Right, but I think that'll have to do. I think that's the best that I can do. It's not bad. Cristiano Ronaldo from the side. Hope it's helpful. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.